Hi everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. Today you're going to learn how to animate a custom logo in After Effects. This logo was designed in Adobe Illustrator. You can download the project file in the link in the description. And here is how I separated the layers. Choose the letter, press Ctrl X, then create a new layer and press Ctrl Shift V. Do the same thing for other logo elements. Alright, let's get started. composition and you can see the settings for the composition. Import your vector file and now we need to create shapes out of these layers. After doing so it's better to clean the mess here. Then we need to rename the elements and color them for better recognizing. Now it is time for the animation. We will start our logo animation with the circle and arrow. Drag the letters a bit further because we will need them later. And now let's animate the circle. We will need three keyframes for this animation. Create first keyframe and drag it further. Then create another, set the value to 110 and drag it in the middle. another one and put the value to 0. Press the F9 to ease them and our first element is ready. We will need to animate the position of this arrow. Open the position keyframe, create one keyframe and drag it further. This will be our end position. Now create another keyframe for the overshoot animation. Drag it to the middle and make this little overshoot animation. The last one we will need to create a start position of the arrow. Do the same thing and drag the arrow down. After setting the keyframes we will need to ease them and adjust the animation graph. Now let's preview it. Now this circle here stays steady but we don't need this so we will need to animate the circle position. In the timeline choose the position settings for the circle layer. First we will need to create two keyframes, start and end position, which will be the same. We will not change the value. Then drag the circle to create this overshoot. After setting the keyframes, ease them and adjust the animation graph. Now let's preview it. It looks nice. For creating the flying leaf effect, we will need to use a few tools. First of it will be the pen tool, because we will need to create a path for the leaf. So we will draw that path with a pen tool. After you're done, search for the path, put a keyframe, and simply copy it. Then go to the leaf layer, choose the position, and copy paste. Now you can see the path here. Select the first and last keyframe and ease them. We'll need to adjust that leaf. For that, first let's adjust the rotation. Put the keyframe for the last position. Then adjust the start position.
Press and hold Alt and drag the keyframes to set the right timing. After that, we will need to work on animation graph. After setting all keyframes, we can find the best timing for the animation. Now let's preview it. I think it looks good. Select the all letters, choose the scale, put the keyframe for all layers, drag it further and make it the last position. Create another one, put the value to 110, then create another one and put the value to 0. 